Welcome back, everybody. Another episode on the um, Do Cakes Varium or Mobs World. I should probably just start calling it Mobs World. But the videos are still all titled Do Cakes Bavarium, and I think that would just be confusing. Um, yeah, so let's get this tower finished up. Uh, for absolutely no reason in particular. Other than because when it was dark, it was next to impossible to see anything. Which is why I'm throwing these torches out real quick here. I've got acacia wood. So I'm going to put that to use here. Um... Let's see, I thought, yeah, that's not all the way out. This is so dangerous. I don't know how this ever passed any sort of safety ratings from anybody. Like this should absolutely have never been given the okay to go ahead. Like just the absolute most dangerous thing ever. I gotta figure out how this works. Okay, so I'm doing a solid ring around every time there's a floor. It appears as if that's the case, so I'll just do that. And put this ring. That's going to put these really close. But that actually... That'll make it impossible to run through. Well, problem solved. I was wondering how I'd make sure people don't fall out, but <sighs> this rail will do just that. Okay, yeah, so that goes like that. And then that corner there. And then this will go around to here. Now, Theoretically, that can all stay open because there's no way you would ever reach that point. Like, I guess you could shift jump to get onto it. But, if you shift jump, you should take full responsibility for the consequences of your actions. You know what I mean? Like, shift jumping can be dangerous. You should... Be aware of the consequences of your actions before you make those actions. And if you're not, well, I'm sorry, but you have nobody but yourself to blame. It's like when ironing manu ironing manufacturers, yeah, when iron manufacturers have to put warnings on their irons, saying, "Warning: Do not iron clothing while wearing." Like, are you kidding me? Do we really need a warning? to tell people to not wear their clothes while they shove a piece of hot metal up against the clothing to remove wrinkles. Like, has humanity really fallen to that state where people are so stupid they are not able to think for themselves and be like, hmm, this iron is a chunk of metal that is very hot. I wonder if I can iron my clothes while I'm wearing them. And they try, and if of course you can, but you'll get burned, and they burn themselves, and now it's the fault of the manufacturer that they were stupid? Like, I'm sorry, but I don't, I don't understand why the manufacturer should be held liable for what obviously is your stupidity. But I guess I'm not a lawyer, so I don't know. I do not know how those things work. Okay, well, let's throw this rail in here. And while we're at it, probably this one as well. Just to make sure everybody's safe. And can't fall off. And to test, you know, I'm just... Ooh, ooh, could I run out here? Ah, I could. That is a dangerous point. I shall... I'll make it safer later. I'll throw some more... Uh, fence pieces in. Should probably get rid of this dirt. Because that just looks ugly. And I hadn't thought about this, but I should probably throw some protector blocks in here too. Because, I mean, 
I, I wouldn't want somebody to come through and wreck my stuff. Which, unfortunately, is what happens. Okay, this top one, I'll put uh, a fence around. So that should be fine. That corner is good. I feel like this corner is missing a, a bunch of upright. Yep. So how can I even get there? Can I even get there? I don't even know. It needs to be off of here. Um, That might be a problem. Uh, Houston... We have a problem. I can't finish building this. Wait. Shift jump. Alright, I think that'll work. If I can reach. Pretty please work. Alright. Oh. Okay. Well, it, it did work. Alright. So then... That should be a corner there. Yep. Uh, I'm not going to have to reach that, though. I shift I can oh wait and this should be connected up too well that was an easy fix oh hey I didn't realize I could reach that all right so back to the stairs we go run around run around run around up to the top everything is safe up here um, maybe I'll put I'll probably have to do a fence around this too. Because again, people are dummies. I think, however, instead of using that fencing, because that takes up half the note, or takes up the full node, I use the fencing like I had down in the aquarium, which I can put right at the very edge. I don't know if I can make an inside corner with that stuff though. Hmm, well. We made it down safely, so that's good. I need to find out. Okay, so one block in the corner will protect the whole thing. And I'll put one right up in that corner. Which will be right here. So if I punch that, that extends to the top. It extends... Wow, down quite a bit. So that will be perfect. Oh, no, I don't want to do that. And then maybe, just maybe, that was here, right? Yeah. So maybe I'll throw one here. Just to make sure. What? It doesn't protect all the way across? What? So, wait, how do I do this? I think I have to have chat on. Protection is located at... So this is protected by the node below it. Okay. This area is not protected, you can build here. I don't want that. Okay, so what I'm going to do then... Is just put a protection block in each corner and I'll call it good at that it's probably more than I need to use but you never know some people just want to mess stuff up all right well that is good then whoa a nyan cat flying through the sky leaving a trail of beautiful beautiful rainbows ah hello not Jonah how we doing today Man, that guy is really loving his... He's not loving it. That's way too small for him. I should not have spawned a whale in there. A well. Um, yeah, I really can't do anything with... With these cages because... I need to get a hold of Moon Kitten Builder. And have them remove all of the animals that they placed. Because I can't kill them. And I need them dead so I can place my stuff where my stuff should be. Oh, uh, what was I coming in here for anyways? Fences. Fences, fences, fences. I will grab all of these fences. 
and I will try to pawn off some of this stuff in there which worked surprisingly throw the seeds in there I don't need those I have so much dirt I'm just gonna start trashing dirt I know horrible horrible how could I do that I could do that because I have that much dirt I don't need more um I thought I had a thing with bones in it someplace but maybe not I don't know uh yeah so let's take a look you see at the fences here I should probably have just searched fence huh oh I could do like this railed fence corner how do I make this fence with two normal fences and I get three small fences what about a barbed wire fence corner that seems really safe for up top right like you wouldn't be uncomfortable with your kids being around barbed wire fence would you I mean I wouldn't I'd be like oh it's the safest thing in the world I'm totally joking by the way I'd be like yeah this isn't safe let's uh let's let's go someplace else where we don't have to worry about you know getting stabbed with a piece of barbed wire okay well I'm gonna need those and those I guess I don't need these fences huh I don't even know where I grabbed this out of miscellaneous probably oh but I got unpainted pickets maybe I should use that I probably should because I already have one or two okay how do I make an unpainted picket mixing is how I make it no I need to know how to make the actual just a whole bunch of sticks okay that seems easy enough I'll give me 60 which then gives me 64 Let's see if that works run all the way around I don't know if the ah, they both should be the exact same distance I imagine I can't see how going one way over the other would be any faster it's the opposite corner Ooh, so dark Let's throw some light up here. That's enough. Okay. Then. Let's figure out. Yeah, see? I am all about safety. That's why I'm putting up this beautiful, beautiful fence. And anybody that doesn't like it, well, you know, they can go jump off a bridge or something. No, I don't want to do that. I actually want to place a block and then put the torch on top of that. That's what I meant to do from the get-go. I even recall saying I was going to. And clearly, then I completely slipped my mind. Ah, oh, man. No, I don't. Why? Okay, so hitting the escape key didn't work. Which is why it kept popping back up. I was just hitting escape. Evidently, that is not the right method to choose. All right, so I have those. That works. Okay, so now I need this corner thing, which I need two. And I get one corner, which makes sense. But how is this going to place? All right, so it placed right. Beautiful. So you can't walk off of there. Then I guess... Oh. Oh, well, wait. This would just be another corner then right just like that um I don't really know here like I feel you know I'll just put a corner in why not I do a corner like that there if you walked out there you can't get around if you go there you fall down so you can't get up I mean, I think that works. And I could always put a roof on it if I wanted. I don't know if there'd really be a point to having a roof on it, but I could. Now, of course, you can still jump and walk right over that fence. In which case, you deserve to die. 
Yep, I said it. You deserve to die if you jump over a fence when you're this high up. Like, this is this is pretty high, folks. This is not where you want to be jumping from. But okay, that is the tower completed. I think that works well. I just have to make uh, three more now. I don't know, the building style looks kind of eh. But it does work. I have to harvest. Oh, it's a horse. I do have to harvest a bunch more acacia wood to get this actually working, but it's all right. Um, whoop. Didn't want to do that. I wanted to visit the garden. Let's see how things are looking in here. Ah, beautiful. Tons of cotton. Wheat's growing good. Raspberries. Carrots. I actually don't think I need any food, so I'm not going to bother harvesting any of that. But it does look good, so that is most excellent. Um, I should really get a better way of doing this. But let's take a look down here. At least I didn't die. Oh, what a cute little toidle. And I feel like there's a wolf. Oh, is he in the pathway? Dude, what are you doing in here, man? Get away. I don't know why he's down here. That whale pretty much takes up the whole enclosure. Oh, and I got a bear in here, too? What is this? They probably wandered in. And then couldn't figure out how to get out. And now they're just stuck. So I guess the humane thing to do... Oh, great. It's tamed. Is it tamed by me? Nope. That's Moon Kitten Builders. Oh, but he's not. Sorry, Mr. Bear. I hate to slaughter you like that, but kind of don't want you in here. I don't particularly want the wolf in here either, but I don't know how to get rid of him. Can't catch him. I'm assuming he won't follow me. Oh, or yes, he will. And I can feed him as well, even though he's not mine. Come on. No, no, there's meat over here. Come on, you know you want it. Yeah, okay, let's see if he'll go upstairs. Come on. Come on. Come in. I think the shark wants the raw meat, too. Let's go up, up the stairs. Come on. We can do this. What? Why are you going back down? No, come up. Come on. Let's get out of the aquarium. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I have some raw meat for you. Oh, whatever. He's out. Oh, don't go right back into there, you. No. Are you kidding me? I just lured you out with raw flesh. <laughs> and you're going to go right back. Ungrateful animal. I think he did. He's probably trying to attack. Oh, wait. Yeah, he's... I don't know what he's trying to do. He's probably trying to attack something that's down in there. That's in the water. But he can't, because he can't get in the water. Because of the glass. And that bothers him. But... Uh, you know, it is what it is. I think... I think that's going to wrap this up. I got one tower built. We'll get the other towers all put together off camera because it's just going to be a lot of, well, very repetitive stuff. And I honestly don't think anybody really wants to watch it. And I'm going to have to chop down a bunch of those acacia trees so I can get the wood. But actually, let me take a look in the chests here. Yeah, I've got acacia saplings, but that's it. 
no acacia wood. So yeah, that'll all be off camera stuff, but I don't know. We need a good Kodak moment. Good Kodak moment, both for the end card and for uh, and for the video thumbnail. Maybe I should run up to the tower and just take a look across my sprawling vivarium from there. That might be a good idea, huh? Oh, I should have done that fence when I had the fencings on me. Oh, well. We'll just do this and yeah, this will be perfect. So on your right hand side there, you got some links to some of my other videos, which if you got a little free time, check them out. You know, 0415 release video and, and some other random video randomly selected by the YouTube gods. The lithograms, computers, AI, however you want to call it. I don't care, but it's there. And then over on the left, you got a link to my website where you can put in requests for mod reviews or server reviews or freelance work or whatever you want. And uh, of course, there's a subscribe button, which if you haven't already done so, you should totally click that. So you subscribe to my channel and then, uh, yeah, you won't miss out on any more of my quality, amazing content.